some colored pencils. All you need is some colored pencils, some paper, and some scissors, and a bowl of water. Okay, so you're gonna start with a paper, and you are gonna draw a flower. It doesn't matter the size, okay, it doesn't matter the size, it can be as many petals as you want. It is okay, it doesn't have to be perfect. Okay, once you have your flower all drew on the paper, you are going to color it however you want, as many colors that you want to use. It can be colorful, and then however you want. And when you're done coloring, you're gonna cut it out. And when you cut it out, they should look like these, something like this. These are already cut out, so when you have them cut out, you're gonna get each petal and fold it to be in the center, like this. You don't have to press it hard, just normally fold them like this. You can use any type of paper to draw your flower. Just know that if you use a, a hardcover paper, it will take longer for it to bloom, but it will still bloom. It would just take a little longer. So, okay. You have them all folded in the center like this. Okay. It's okay if they're kind of opening. That's okay too. And now you're gonna get your water, your bowl of water, and you're just gonna toss them inside and wait for them to bloom. See, that one already bloomed. That one is blooming. This one is taking a while. This one's a hardcover. These two are normal paper. So it's easier for them to bloom. And yeah. And yeah, you have flower blooming. And it's pretty easy, pretty quick to make. All I have to do is draw the, the, the flower, cut them out, and throw them inside the water, and they will bloom.